Good morning, good evening. Um, Sunday night here. I didn't work this weekend, but kids are in bed now, so I thought I'd just come out here and get a little head start on tomorrow's work. Uh, I'm just going to cut these sills to uh, size, have my rough openings for my windows done. I brought some lumber up to the cabin build um, this morning. Should have left it down here because I just cut some of those bridges right here. It'd be way easier than using my circular saw with the battery. Worry about my battery power and that dying. So I'll bring this sill up. I'll grab some of that other. Uh, I got a couple of two by fours and then sixes for my bridging. Um, so I'll bring that down. So I might as well cut some of that now, but I'll bring you in. <laughs> Beautiful night. That log cabin looks nice. Lit up at night. Broken pencil. Hands are getting cold. I think I'll call that a night. Um, that saved me a half hour at least for tomorrow. So there you go. Um, good deal. Anyways, thanks for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. All right, wait. Okay, well, I got this old I beam. I didn't know what I was ever going to do with it. Um, but I'm going to try to cut it to make some brackets for my truss. I just don't like. There's a couple of little gaps in my truss, so I want to uh, cut these off, paint them black, and then th put some holes in them, and then screw them up on that truss um, to cover up those gaps. So we'll see how this works. It might be just easier in the end to buy some brackets, but I'll try this first anyway. Heavy duty steel there. Wasn't too bad. Maybe spent more in electricity and cutoff wheels than I would have spent in the pieces, but all right, we'll clean them up and then uh, gotta punch some holes in them and see how it goes. Holes here, I marked them in the rust first and then I'll clean these pieces up after. Um, but these are where my screws are gonna go into my logs, so there we go.
Yeah. Well, I'm pretty happy with that. Um, yeah, I spent my whole morning doing this project, but I think it'll pay off in the end. So I'm gonna go eat some lunch. My wife actually has got the, I had her get stop at the hardware store to get the uh, screws I want to put in there. So I uh, should be back with that. And then I'll put these up after lunch and then I'll see what I can get done on the floor joist uh, bridging. Um, so, all right, thanks for watching. So I finished my bridging on that side. Got it almost done in the middle and I'm starting down that other side now, so. All right, I got my joist bridging done. I think I'm ready for insulation in the floor. So I plan to f use a two inch foam board between uh, the joists here. Um, and then uh, obviously put some plywood floor over, subfloor over it. Um, and I don't know what my flooring will be on top of that yet. That's a long ways off, but I do think I'm gonna do the foam board now or this week and then uh, get the plywood on it on it um so i can work the walls higher and easier um but there's the bridging it seems like it took forever but uh got it done so uh that's the wrap for the day and then there's the brackets on the trusses that i completed this morning so they look pretty black but it's just because the logs are so white i think but i think they'll i think they'll look good <laughs>